Welcome back, everybody, in the kitchen with Gita, and we're making another one of her Thanksgiving side dish recipes. Um, I'm all about the sides at Thanksgiving. I know. You know turkey's great, mashed potatoes are great, but it's fun to try different different new sides other than that the green bean casserole, which I do still happen <laughs> to love. Um, but if you make the turkey a little dry, nobody will notice if you got a lot of sides. Totally true. So <laughs> Good tip there, Gita. Which I have. For the first time that I've cooked turkey, I made it a little dry, but it, it happens. It yes. happens. Now base, I'm a professional. Base, base. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, so this is a fun one that you actually came up with. And yeah. reminds me, when I was looking over it, I thought, oh, this reminds me like of the cream spinach. When you ever go to like one of those steakhouses right. uh, in the big cities, and they normally have uh, cream spinach on the menu. And and it's so good. Oh, it is, I, I always have to order it. I have to. Yeah. So this, instead of spinach, we're going to use actually arugula? Yep, arugula. You can use spinach if you like it better. Desmond says he chokes on these. <laughs> um, but I just like it. It's like fresh greens. Yep. Um, yep. And I just had, you know, a bunch of mushrooms in my fridge one day, and my cream was going to expire in a few days. And I was like, let me just try it. And I just decided to mix it again. It actually tasted really good. It, this sounds, yeah. I mean, there's nothing that we wouldn't put be the good. Butter in yeah. There. So we got a big old skillet. Yeah, and depending on how many mushrooms you have, you know, depends on how much butter you want to use, but if you're more health conscious, use less butter. Okay. Um, if you want to use olive oil, you can. I just find the butter gives it a good flavor. Oh, butter and mushrooms, I mean, come on. <laughs> right. Several different types of mushrooms. Right. Um, and the cool thing is, is it used to be hard to find all these specialty right. mushrooms. Um, not anymore. You can just go to the regular grocery store. We Anywhere. Have, yeah, some funky looking, you know, we've got oyster mushrooms, or mushrooms, we've got... Portobello. Baby Bellas, um, so all different kinds of fun right. mushrooms. And button mushrooms you could throw in there too, right? And they're easy to cut. Yep. And we just wiped them with a, a damp cloth. That's really oh, the yeah, best yeah, way yeah. to do mushrooms. Thanks. And you can um, even, yeah, go ahead and add the... Uh, this is some diced onions. Diced onions. Gives it another good little flavor. Oh. And you just want to oh, soften so them up. You see, and it's so quick too. I'm all about quick because I cook so much. You know, I'm cooking breakfast and goodness he eats lunch away but I would cook lunch and I cook dinner just because I'm trying to give him some like healthy meals um, you know and just homemade is always better I you agree. know oh this smells so good and this would not just be perfect for Thanksgiving it'd be great to go with the steak on the grill or you know Absolutely. really any kind of year <laughs> yeah mushrooms I think are good with steak um, I've even tried I just wrote just did some mushrooms similar to this no arugula no whipping cream but I um, added some flour to give it like a gravy feel. Mm -hmm. So I mean you can do anything with Yum. mushrooms. Yeah. Yeah. So okay. we want to wait till it kind of softens up. Okay. And we can add this is cumin. So we're going to give a little, a little smoky yeah. flavor to this. A little dish. bit of cumin. You like your cumin don't you? I do. Yeah. I think it's because I'm Indian. <laughs> Yum. They use it in everything. It's good for you. And then we're mm. going to do, um, this is roasted garlic but I actually sometimes use just garlic powder. This is gar garlic salt. Uh huh. Okay. Um, or I use fresh garlic, fresh diced garlic. Okay. Which tastes, you know, so flavorful. I'm and when you roast it like that, it tastes good. A little bit of olive oil. I can just tell those mushrooms Sticky. really, they, well, they just soak it up. You know what I mean? Yeah. So we're going to use a little, you can do extra butter, but a little oil. I can just tell yeah. it needs it. And mm. olive oil is not too bad for you. Just, mm. don't, just don't use vegetable oil here. Right. <laughs> oh. You could smell it. It smells so good. Oh, I my know. goodness. And then gracious. we can now add the arugula here. Okay. Just so add just a little bit. We're going to so. chop it. Sure. They like said Desmond always says he chokes on this, and it's a good way to hide the greens, you know. Just add it in here. You bet. And you can add as much as you want, as much as you feel necessary, or as much as you want to trick your kids into eating greens. This is one of those things, though. I don't think that this would be a great make-ahead. I think it's one of those things. It's you know. Yeah. You, you got to make it fresh. Yeah. Because it's not going to taste as good. Yeah. I, I wouldn't refrigerate. I think this yeah. is an eat now yeah. kind yeah. of meal. Totally with yeah. you. Oh, this smells good. So now we're going to do our heavy cream, right? Right. The mushrooms have cooked down. And they're even good like that. Like I Ooh, said, yeah. if you're health conscious, another option is just eat them like this. Yep. Yep. Um, but it tastes so much better with that. A little heavy cream in here. Cream yes. makes everything better. So you tell me when. Okay. That's good for now. Okay. Let's just mix it in a little bit. Always add a little more. And that's pretty, that's good. I mean, you can add a little bit more depending, like I said, how many mushrooms you've cut or what's not. But you can eat it just like this. Mm. And oh, I see good some Parmesan looks. cheese over oh, yes. there. And now we're just going to add the Parmesan right on top. Um, we can do it after we put it in the bowl okay. or whatever way you want. Um, so you don't, do, you don't add it to the mushrooms, you add it on top. I add it on top. You can add it in there if it gets a little melted. See, this is, this is not the fresh one. I use the fresh, you know, grated Parmesan. 
and then you put it in because it'll melt. But this we one, have the fresh. We do? Hold on. Yeah, we do. Okay, there we go. I'm going to look for it a second. I know we do. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I knew we had it. There you go. Yeah. So we can just add that in, and it kind of melts in there, too. Tastes a little better. Oh, maybe this was the fresh. There you go. And then a little bit on top. Yeah, Ooh. a little bit on top. Looks so good. Mm. I am quite hungry. I am too. And this <laughs> nothing. I mean, mushrooms and onions sautéing. That is a beautiful thing. So this is going to be another one of your side dishes that you're making for Thanksgiving. I am. Do you know where you're going to be this year? We're not sure. We might be in Minnesota. Have the newbies over again. Um, in case like people don't know, a lot of times what we do for Thanksgiving is we'll have like the younger guys on the team. Similar to what Jennifer Pickett and her family does, um, just just because it gets lonely if you're a rookie yep. and you don't know how to cook. So we invite people over. So we're either going to be there um, or in California. Well, I hope no matter where you are, um, you have a wonderful Thanksgiving. Well, thank you so much. It was so great to see you, Gita, and catch up. And please come back anytime and share your recipes. So, so delicious. We've got a little, it's Wisconsin. You're in Wisconsin now, Gita, so we need a little more cheese on the top, don't yes. you think? Oh, sure. they could smell the some uh, pepper here. Oh, yeah, well. let's do some pepper on top of that. Oh, Yummy. Just, how good does that look? Gosh, girl, you are so talented. <laughs> I would have never is. thought. She cooks like yeah. three meals a day. You don't think I cook? I would have never <laughs> thought to mix so that, though. Oh, yeah. I know, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's not good. inventive. All right. Ladies, you're hungry? Yeah. It, uh, yeah. All right. Yeah. You guys try? Mushroom? Oh, sweet potato pone. Sweet potato pone. There you go. Is that similar? It is. Yeah, yeah. Ours is just a trough. Low yeah. more, yeah. but yeah. we'll be right back. The ladies are going to dig in and let you know how to, what we think of it, Gita. Yeah. <laughs> Versus driving. Honest. 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 Stay with us. You're watching the better half.